Today is National Denim Day, a day of awareness for sexual assault. The Women's Resource and Action Center continued a long-standing tradition yesterday to bring attention to sexual violence and support survivors. DITV's Tara Gillespie spoke with people about the impact of this tradition. Despite the recent dissolve of RVAP, the Women's Resource and Action Center hosted this rally on the Pentecrest to ensure that no sexual violence survivor feels alone. Take Back the Night is a continuous rally in support of sexual violence survivors. It's a community-wide problem. Um, even if you haven't experienced it yourself, almost everybody here can probably say that they know someone who's experienced it. The rally offers a variety of resources to make survivors feel safe and heard. I think it makes you feel a little bit safer that there's more people on campus and in the city that care. Following a march in downtown Iowa City, survivors were able to speak about their experiences with people who understand. Save Many people come here never having spoken to anybody about what happened to them. Participants at the event believe this can encourage others to have the space to safely speak up about their own experiences. Because sometimes it may feel like this is something that happens, but this is something that doesn't happen to us or to our community. Organizations such as RVAP, the Johnson County Sexual Assault Response Team, and DIVP set up tables to let survivors know the resources and services they can use. More people are aware of our yeah. services and know where and how to get help, um, and that's really encouraging. From the 70s until now, Take Back the Night plans to continue for as long as needed. From the Pentecrest, Tara Gillespie, DITV.